Hi there, it's Alex here. Today I want to show you a recipe of a dish that is as uh, delicious as it's harmful. We call it Peter's Shaverma. And uh, this is my first attempt to film a cooking video and let's see what happens. And if you're a vegetarian, uh, just skip this video because it's impossible to cook uh, that dish uh, without meat. And though, if you know how to cook it without meat, uh, make sure to write about it in the comment section. Here we go. Let's start with the highlight of the dish. Let's start with the sauce. We can do nothing without it. You don't even have to try. Take a bowl, pour 100 ml of uh, ryazhanka. I don't know how to translate it uh, in English correctly, but it's uh, something like a, a fermented milk uh, drink. Now let's add 100 ml of mayonnaise and another 100 ml of uh, sauce cream. Smetana. <laughs> we need some lemons, but we have just this piece. Add some lemon juice. Then it's time for a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of salt, and a pinch of sugar. Then let's add some uh, curry. Sorry, the battery is dead. So add some paper and mili sundali. I have no idea how it's called in English, but I think it's the same. It's a Georgian thing. And finally, add. Three, uh, three cloves of garlic. If you have a uh, garlic press, use it. We don't have, so we will use a small grater. That's it. Now let's mix everything carefully to a single consistency. Well, the sauce is ready. Now let's turn to meat. We will cook from, from chicken things. So, um, first uh, we have to mar uh, marinate, it, marinate it well. Put, uh, let's put the chicken into the bowl. Salt and uh, pepper the meat. Add some pepper and add some garlic. Just, uh, just like uh, for making the sauce, we will use a grater, but you can use a garlic press. Now let's add some olive, olive oil. And next, Let's mix everything very well and leave for 50 to 20 minutes. Okay, let's make uh, a salad. Chop onion, cucumbers and tomatoes. Let's dip uh, the onion into the into the boiler. Where is the boiler? The boiler of water. Let's dip the onion into the boiler water. I think uh, one minute will be enough. If we do it uh, to onion doesn't uh, taste bitter. And now let's mix everything well. Uh, 
The salad is ready. The next step, let's fry the chicken. Oil. While the meat is cooking, let's prepare the pita bread. Separate them. The pita bread is almost ready. The chicken is ready and uh, the next step is uh, very responsible. Therefore, my better half will continue to cook. To remove excess fat, we spread the chicken on paper towels. Then we cut the chicken. Now we need to fry our pita bread little. Pita bread is ready. Spread the pita bread on the paper. Add the chicken and the salad. Pour over the sauce and wrap it up. Well, uh, let's taste it. The taste is crazy. Bon appetit and see you in the comment section as usual. Bye!